What I want to do today is connect our Google Sheets and Slack apps so that when a row is either filled out or updated on our Google Sheets, a new message will automatically be posted in our selected Slack channel. Zapier is a no-code tool that makes it easier for anyone to automate workflows across 5,000 plus apps. If you don't have an account, there's a link in the description for a free two-week trial, so you could try it risk-free. Let's dive in. In order to get started with this workflow, I need to create a Zap. I can do this by clicking the Create Zap button on the left-hand side of the screen. Once I do this, I'll need to set up a trigger. Because I want my Google Sheets to trigger a message in my Slack app, I'll need to use Google Sheets as my trigger. I can find the app by typing it into the search bar and clicking below. The trigger screen will then pop up. I should click New or Updated Spreadsheet Row as my event and click Continue. The first time we set up a trigger, we'll need to authenticate the app with Zapier. A link will pop up for you to log into your Google account. Don't worry, it's totally safe because Zapier uses industry standards for encryption when connecting with each of your apps. I'll put a link to that in the description as well. Once that's complete, let's set up our trigger apps data. Under Spreadsheet, click the spreadsheet you want to use for your Zap. I'm going to click Zapier Project Plans. Under Worksheet, I'll click Sheet 1 and then I'll click Continue. Next, click Test Trigger and you're all set with the first step. Click Continue and we can start creating our action. Type in Slack into the search bar and select it on the drop down menu. Next, click Send Channel Message and click Continue. From there, I can select our account and authenticate Slack with Zapier, just like I did with my Google account. By the way, if at any point you get stuck, Zapier's got an amazing support team that can help you out. There's a link in the description to their forum post for this specific workflow. Click Continue and we can start to assign our Trigger Apps data into the Action Apps field. First, pick the channel you want your data to appear on. I'm going to click General. Under Message Text, I'll put in a custom message. I'll click Project and then type Spreadsheet has been updated in Google Sheets. Check it out at, and then I'll click Link under the dropdown. And then I'll click Continue. Click Test Action, and I should be all set. Yep, there it is. This is ready to turn on. Now, anytime a spreadsheet is either updated or created in Google Sheets, a message will automatically be sent out into our selected Slack channel. I hope this was a helpful demo. Zapier can do so much more with these two apps and thousands of others. Check Zapier out. There's a free trial. Click the link in the description.